Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. This is my crashed Audi A3 uh, 1.8 TFSI engine. This is how it is looking after all the body parts are uh, back on the car. This gap here is a little bit bigger but the front bumper is not on its final position. If we this will close and look nice. It's looking okay. And now let's see how did it get in this stage. I did a little work of camera. I installed the fender, the left fender and all the inner uh, the pieces that come uh, here from the fender to the door the gap is very good the color match is good now that uh, is uh, like a, a week and a half two weeks since I uh, painted it looks very good let's go to the other side and uh, install them Defender. have the fenders mounted all the screws I will have to I will play now with the gaps on the hood I need to move a little bit the hood back here the gaps okay and the other side is okay and here but the the bonnet is in front is little bit like finger near this I have to move inside a little bit and a little bit in here I guess we'll see once I get it there but the gaps are not my problem I'm used to getting to play with gaps every day So small things can uh, <laughs> screw your gaps. So this uh, is a piece that is uh, from the previous, uh, from the old fender, the 
this uh, bracket here and because that was pushed outside is the distance between here and here is uh, bigger that in this side that uh, here uh, this wasn't damaged so uh, my old bonnet sits lower there in this corner because uh, this is this corner is higher that must be and since it's higher the gap is uh, off so let's try to get that in uh, in the right high So the gaps are fine now. I use it the uh, aftermarket parts, the uh, bonnet and the two fenders, and of course the front bumper. That is not bad. I can see with the other. Okay. This side. I'm uh, happy about the end result. So let's get the headlights. So I installed the headlights, I will uh, fit them finally when I will uh, get the bumper and the radiator uh, grill on, until then the uh, cuts are very good.
without the horns. This was a little bit damaging crash. Was not uh, removed from the car by me, was by a friend of mine, the one that picked up the car in uh, Deutschland. And uh, when you don't remove it yourself, you really have to guess how that was. Let me show you. This comes here. In the right side, in the passenger side, is uh, everything mounted. I need to put the headlight. I'll put it right now. The horns, the windshield, the liquid the reservoir is here. I need that carbon fiber filter to install in here. To see how that came okay let's put the headlight all the headlights are installed let's prepare the bumper let's remove the screws
was not a big fan of the honeycomb uh, grill radiator grill but this looks very nice let's put it on the car the bumper is on the car fits pretty good for uh, an aftermarket uh, piece we have no screws installed in here we have uh, two more screws to put there for the final assembly here two I don't know if this looks better uh, without uh, the Audi logo let me put it in here okay looks nice with the uh, So that's it for this uh, episode, only a few steps until the complete of the, this car, I have to change the windshield and the airbags and tiny things here and there to complete it, the fog lights, the bumper grills, thanks for watching.